this work is work number 850 <laughs> or 850. I can't always think how to title things, so I always use numbers just to have a way of identifying what I do, <laughs> what I try to do. But, um, and the work will, it consists of people running through the gallery or it consists of a person running through the gallery every 30 seconds. I was asked by the Tate to, if I would, could think that I might imagine making something for the Devine galleries. And, uh, and immediately this is what I thought of. And, and I thought that the Devine galleries being so long were a good theater for this work. Because uh, it's almost the length of, say, a sprinting, like an indoor sprinting uh, track. If I think about running and why it is that I like it, I, I think that it is perhaps because it's a, a, an, an exciting action. And I think it's also an example of being alive if you think of death as being still, perfectly still, and uh, so the opposite of death would be, you know, to move as fast as you possibly can. And uh, and I think of art or the experience of art always as an as a live experience. You know, the uh, you know a painting may be a fixed static object, but the experience of looking at a painting is. Um, always a live one because, uh, you know, because people are alive and constantly moving, you know, the heart's beating. So the experience of looking at things is always in, in, in movement, you know, and, and in my mind there isn't such a leap from, therefore, from a painting to a person running in the gallery, you know, which is of course a, a, a moving or, or kinetic uh, work. That's not necessarily, you know, why I made this piece. I made the piece, I think, originally I, when I thought about it because I thought it was uh, funny, really, you know, and, and uh, I made, it makes me smile, you know, when I see people running through the gallery, you know. When I was working on a piece, I, I, I was thinking, that, you know, like in the street, if you're in the street and someone runs past, you know, it's often can be quite shocking. Like, oh, what's happening? You know, like, has there been a theft or a, you know, um, like a shoplifter running away from the police or something like that? It can be quite shocking when you see someone running in, in the street. So I think running in general stands out, you know, uh, probably the one place it wouldn't stand out would be like an athletics meeting, <laughs> you know? So that would probably be not the place to display the running piece, you know? You know, artists do not make art. Ar artists make things, you know, ob objects, whatever it may be, paintings, sculptures. They make stupid objects, which get used as art, you know, by, uh, by human beings. So, you know, it, so someone should not and I'm actually not the person to ask about whether this is art, because it's not me that decides if something's art or not, you know. <laughs> the person asking that question can, you know, decide for themselves or should, or should you know, question in general the, the fact that certain objects are used and treated as art by, you know, the general world that we live in, you know. You know, arts, just a word, you know. <laughs>